Hey guys, this is JNT, and welcome back to Let's Play The Legend of Zelda Phantom Hourglass. So, uh, we're here at the beginning of the game. Seems to be running a little slow. I don't know why. It might be the uh, recorder that's, at, that's making it happen. Hopefully it'll operate okay. Oh there, friend! Try tapping me! Okay. Yep, that's how it's done. Just tap on people to speak with them. Try tapping on other things like signs and barrels. Uh, okay. I believe this is the house that we were supposed to go to. What does this guy have to say? Ah, hello, traveler. So your name is Link. I am Oceus, and I live on this island. Ciela told me all about what happened to you. I also hear your friend was taken by the ghost ship. I understand that you want to find the ghost ship, but you must not. But Grandpa, what are you saying? Link's friend was carried away. Pure evil fills the sails of the ghost ship. It roams the seas in search of victims to capture. And no one has ever escaped from it. It's best if you stay away, far away from that ghost ship. No, to seek out that ship is to seek out your doom. That's, That's why we have to do something, Grandpa. Oh, mercy. Hmm. You've already made up your mind, haven't you? Young people. There is a port to the east of here. A sailor by the name of Lineback should be there. He'll be willing to tell you more about the ghost ship. Look at your map. The harbor is here. You mean that guy who came to visit, Grandpa? He asked about the ghost ship. I remember him. I'll go with Link and show him who he is. It's okay, right, Grandpa? Yes, I don't see why you can't go along. I'm sure you can help, Link. Thank you, Grandpa. Let's go, Link. She's always been antsy, that one. Now, Link, lately there have been many monster sightings. I give in to you. I gave in to you and told you about Lineback, but you be careful out there. Yeah, yeah, okay. Okay. What the? What's that rumbling? Another earthquake? So many quakes lately, so many monsters. Bad signs for sure. And I bet there are even worse things to come. What does this sign say? To the port. Lovely. Oh heavens, that quake just broke the bridge again. So many quakes lately and the bridge breaks every time there's a big one. There is a second way to get to town, fortunately. Unfortunately, it leads through a frightening cave full of monsters. What to do? Well, wait for the bridge to be fixed, of course. Yeah, we're not going to do that. <laughs> what does the old guy say? So that the earthquake broke the bridge, did it? Ah, unfortunate. There is another way to the port, but it's far too dangerous. No, wait for someone to rebuild the bridge. That's the only safe course. Don't even think about braving the path to the north. And... He says don't even think about it, so of course that's where we're going to go. Uh, but first we're going to help this guy out. Anyway, I've just had a bit of bad luck with my garden here. That quake just heaved a bunch of rocks into the middle of my patch. 
Would you mind moving them? Simply tap on a rock to pick it up, then tap where you want to throw it. Okay. We want to throw it at the chicken. Because it wouldn't be Zelda without torturing a chicken. Thanks a plenty. You really helped me out there. Not much, but here's something for your trouble. Please, I insist. We got one ruby. What's with the dirty look? Think I'm a cheapskate? Fine, then here's a hot tip. Look at your map. There's a tree on that spot. Go bash it really hard. That spot right there. I'd recommend that you jot that down on your map before you forget it. So let's do that right now. There, mark. To scribble on your map, tap menu, then tap map. And we're going to go and raid his house too. I've heard that the ghost ship is on the prowl again, stealing more islanders. So very dangerous. What does this guy have in his barrels? Eh, just a few rubies. Okay. Monsters! Look out, Link! It's way too dangerous. You need something to defend yourself with. We have to go back. Okay, fine. Danger! Monsters ahead! You don't say. Well, let's try some exploring. Hmm. A cave with a barrel across its entrance. Could that be a sign that people don't want us to go in there? Nah. Grandpa uses this cave as his storehouse. Keep your hands off my things. Please ask first. Ocious. Hmm. Well, looks like we can't get in, so let's just head off. need to go back to and talk to the old man again. Okay, Grandpa, what do you have to say this time? Tried the path to the north, did you? Celia, don't pretend you forgot I told you never to go that way. We've seen so many quakes rattle the island lately, Link. And monsters have been seen closer and closer to town. Be cautious, young ones. That cave up north leads to the port, it's true. But that path will be crawling with monsters. Do not even think of it. I'm sure someone will get around to repairing the bridge. Um, uh, we're not that patient. Well, Grandpa wants us to stay out of trouble, but we need to find your friend. If only you found a sword. Then you could show those monsters. Well, let's try exploring this cave again. I think I remember Grandpa storing a sword back there. Now, how to get this door open? I remember he cracks open the door by writing a number on that sign. I think he says it's the number of palm trees on the beach. Sneaky! Okay. Well, we're pretty much out of time, but, um... Well, we'll take the long way around to the beach. 
Okay, so the beach is just right here, and we will get... We will start counting palm trees next time. So once again, I am JNT, and we're playing through the Legend of Zelda Phantom Hourglass. Have a great day. Bye.